Martin. So we talked about one local Buckeye awaiting his NFL future, and another will listen for his name at this week's NFL Draft 2. Yeah, John, you may recognize the little boy behind us. He could look slightly familiar. It's former star Buckeye defensive lineman Draymond Jones. The Cleveland native is currently getting ready for the NFL Draft, and while most of us here in Northeast Ohio learned his name through his accomplishments at St. Ignatius or at Ohio State, we caught up with a woman who has known him much longer. He just knows I'm there for him. No matter what he does, I'm a good supporter of his. I think the world of him. Before the scouts, before the Big Ten, before Ohio State, NFL prospect Draymond Jones met Jane Ann Ertzman. Draymond showed up and he was really tall and I thought he was in the wrong room. Mrs. Ertzman was Draymond's kindergarten teacher. The most important thing, obviously, to get as much out of kindergarten, learn as much as they possibly could, but also learn to be good people. Draymond aced kindergarten. He was very well behaved, he was smart, he was a good listener, and he was very kind. When he finished the school year, He's the two the went their separate time. ways. He's good on the second. That is, until Mrs. Ertzman spotted Draymond at a basketball game his freshman year at St. Ignatius while there to watch another former student. From then on, I watched him every game he was in. The ball is stripped by J Draymond Jones. He picks it up. He's going and his football quickly. games, I usually lasted till about the third quarter, but then I got too cold. Draymond Jones, what a way to start off a game on defense. And right in front of her, the little boy that Mrs. Ertzman adored turned into a young man that she is proud to support. On his basketball senior night, um, they always give their parents usually a bouquet of flowers. And he had two bouquets. He left the line of parents. And he came over to me and gave me a bouquet. <laughs> Well, Mrs. Ertzman aimed to teach all of her students to be good people. It is a lesson then and now Draymond did not need to learn. I was lucky. He came to me like that. I didn't have to teach him that. Wow. Yeah, so sweet. And Mrs. Ertzman wants me to make sure that everyone knows that she's extremely proud of the fact that he got his education. We all are. And like Paris, another guy that just seems like an even better person than he is a football player. So we're rooting for them whether they end up on the Browns or not. And he's a good football player, too. He's a really good football player. <laughs>